для того, чтобы у детей остался образ решения физического противоречия, мы делаем еще пособие. And for uh, the children to have the visual image uh, for different way of contradiction resolution, yeah. we also develop these uh, visual images. Или же ставим на круги лулия схемки. Or another thing we do, we put the visual images onto the lulia circles. Uh, pra, и, uh, например, круги лулия. For example, Lula circles. Значок времени. So the symbol of time. Агрегат там, агрегатное состояние. Aggregate state. И так далее. You should recognize the symbols. Yeah, but uh, they've been introduced, so when you tell them, now they know the symbols, and then you put them there. А сюда ставятся картинки. Утюг. And here you put the objects, for example, the picture of an iron. Зонтик or an umbrella, computer, a computer, и так далее. and so on. Крутится. So then we turn it. И ребенок а, а, говорит, что в утюге. And then the child might say, if we take an iron, поработал волшебник а, изменения пространства. For example, uh, an iron has come across the uh, wizard of space transformation. Я спрашиваю, почему? And then I ask, why do you think so? А потому что он некоторое время греет в этом месте, а потом вот это белье. Я говорю, да, но это разве вот в этом утюге? So if there is an iron and there is this uh, plus and minus in space, that what the child might say when they look at it, they might say, for example, that the example of uh, time transformation is that when we use an iron, so it is hot here, but it is not hot there, because we didn't use the iron there. And then the teacher would say, well, but in this case, are we speaking about uh, one, one iron, or are we speaking about two different parts of space? So because that was not actually the correct answer. На самом деле, другой ребенок говорит, нет, это пространство, часть утюга горячая, а часть холодная. Uh, and then the other child would say, no, no, in the space, so we should say that one part of, an, of the iron is cold and the other part of the iron is hot. И получается анализ uh, бытовых объектов. And, uh, and then what we actually have as a result is the analysis of the objects around us.